Hello, and welcome to the My Farm Minute video series. My name is Pete Edelson, and I'm an account manager with AgriSecure. In this video, we'll cover work orders, which were previously known as the activity manager. So let's get started. Once you've logged into My Farm, which can be found at http colon slash slash myfarm.agrisecure.com, you'll be directed to your grower dashboard, which is the page we see here. From here, you will have the option to toggle between different crop years if you wish. For our purposes, we'll stay with 2019, and we'll click the blue show button to the right to refresh the data below. To navigate to the work orders page, you'll likely have a couple of options. In the alerts section, you may see a work orders are overdue line item. To get to work orders, you can simply click that, or you can click the operations tab at the top and select work orders. Straight away, some of the filters at the top of the page are preset. Let's click the blue search button to search that data. Here's a list of overdue work orders, sorted by oldest first. The table displays field, crop, type, activity, date, and status. And one thing to note is that any work order with a budget status is not completed. Completing work orders can be done either on your phone or here on a computer. To complete it on a computer, click on a specific work order. And you'll notice that you can't edit most of the information on this pop-up. That data is being pulled from GreenTrace, uh, where most of the planning and budgeting took place. The three editable items are the actual date, any notes you'd like to put in there, and any clean-out uh, selection required. Once you've finished with that, you can click the Update Work Order button at the bottom, and you're done completing that work order. This will conclude this video. As always, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to your account executive, or you can email us at contact at agrisecure.com. Thanks for watching.